Welcome again. Right now we're at 2 Corinthians chapter 2, verses 12 through to the end of the chapter, verse 17. It's all about perspective. Paul writes, Now when I came to Troas for the good news of Christ, and when a door was opened to me in the Lord, I had no relief for my spirit, because I didn't find Titus, my brother. But taking my leave of them, I went out to Macedonia. Now thanks be to God, who always leads us in triumph in Christ, in the Messiah, and reveals through us the sweet aroma of his knowledge. That's why we're reading the scriptures. That's why we're going through the scriptures word for word. See, Christ reveals through us the sweet aroma of his knowledge in every place. For we are a sweet aroma of Christ to God in those who are saved and in those who perish. To the one, a stench from death to death. To the other, a sweet aroma from life to life. Who is sufficient for these things? For we are not as so many peddling the word of God, but as of sincerity, but as of God. In the sight of God, we speak in Christ. See, Paul said to some people, to those who perish, who are on their way to punishment, to the wrath of God, that are on their way to eternal torment in hell. To those people, we are the stench of death. You say, how does that, how can that be? Because you see, the real true message of the gospel is a message of judgment. You are going to be judged if you don't repent. Remember, let's not forget, the whole message of the gospel is founded upon repentance. Jesus died so that we could repent, so that we could look at him and say what Paul said in Galatians chapter 2, verse 20. I am crucified with Christ. Nevertheless, I live. Yet not I, but Christ lives in me. In the life I now live in the flesh, in this body, I live by the faith of the one who loved me and gave himself for me. So guess what? If you are dead, if you are completely crucified with Christ, then you live in righteousness. You live completely for him. You don't live for yourself. You don't live for the gratification of the moment. You live for God. You are sacrificed. You have sacrificed yourself. So it's all about self-sacrifice. But what a lot of people don't realize is that through faith, we are crucified with Christ. Our lusts, our sinful self, our old man is dead. Our sin is dead. But also through faith in Christ, faith in his resurrection, we are raised with him in newness of life. We live in perfect harmony with Jesus, in perfect harmony with the Torah. So to those who are still in sin, yeah, we're the stench of death because we are calling for death to sin. But to those who are saved, to those who really belong to Jesus, we are the sweet aroma of life because we live in newness of life and righteousness and holiness. Seek God with all your heart. And if you do, you will find him. Call upon him and he will show you great and mighty things. Love you guys.